streams that I like too, because I just have to sit back and ramble about crazy <laughs> stuff. Move your my, character my every once in a while. Yeah, I got to move the controller once in a while. Look at a couple of people's cars. Hey. And this week, and Nami is not charging anything. Makes me want to close my application and come back and hey, do it again. You can take over this Zero money. Here we go. So did it ever lag anymore? Uh, I've been experiencing some situations where, so the other day I was out like in Pleto Bay and I was just messing around. I was doing like a resupply or something like that, uh, messing around with career challenges. And all of a sudden, like started lagging out crazy. And then I blew myself up and I was fine. Another time too, had to close application. Other times too, had to freaking, so yeah, it's been happening, happening like numerous amount of times. And it, uh, ever since I noticed that it started happening is because the, uh, GTA, fix for the um basically the cluck and bow like cluck oh. and bells like broke gta you know and you read that one thing too from like gta like rockstar right and they were saying like hey guys like gta is like at its point for like what we can add to it we can't really add too yeah. much more here like they actually had like a newsletter thing at some point like last mm -hmm. uh it was a while ago yeah i think some i read somewhere too uh gta has announced something about the summer dlc They've announced the summer DLC already. Yeah, not they haven't announced it, but they've announced something about it. Huh, I wonder what that is. Uh, yeah, I, know, I didn't read too far in it. I just That's what people are wondering too. Like, what do you what do you think the remainder the remaining days of GTA is gonna be like? I, I didn't read too far in it. Whoa! Hitting the like button. Yeah, we're over here on PlayStation Five. Closed crew session. Just chilling for a little bit. Trying to do one of these uh, before Wednesday's... T wait, yeah, Wednesday night tunables tomorrow. So it's just... It doesn't do the person. It just does... It just does the stick. <laughs> Let's bust out. Let's bust out with some editing here. Dude, I gotta learn how to edit... Or I gotta learn how to live stream on my... Through, like, OBS and stuff on my PC. I'm telling you. Like, it's gonna make things way better. Because over there, I don't have to add any, edit anything, like, during, like, whatever stream or anything like that. Like, everything's pre, pre-built. pre And, you know, like, take as much time as you want. That's why I was gonna play some, uh, some PC games or something here. <clears throat> some PC. It's not just a. It's not a gaming channel though. It's like a. It's, that, that's what sucks. Is this? It's not a gaming channel. It's a GTA channel. <laughs> <laughs> Try to do anything else. People are like, "What? It, what is this? What are you talking about, man? I don't understand. How come the? How come you're not playing GTA? Because I like other games. Yeah, I, I like to play a lot of other games. The only the only thing about it though is like with other games, I don't stick with other games necessarily. I usually like play other games, I beat them, and then I go I walk away. Bounce like Call around. of Duty too. I've been, dude, I've been playing Call of Duty like ever since Call of Duty has been like Call of Duty for like the last twenty years or something like that. I've been playing Call of Duties. Mm. You know my favorite Call of Duties though, the World War II ones. I really love the World War II stuff, and like I know some people are like, ah, I don't like the World War II guns. Be like, yeah, but they got some good guns over there for World World War II. I think. I mean, all the World War II guns basically, and you got that that M4, whatever that rifle. Oh, dude, I was so good with that. Just headshot, 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 killing Nazis left and right. I was the I was the best Nazi killer. Yeah, Modern Warfare too. Yeah, there's some good, uh, good Call of Duties back in the day. That's why I always feel like they should bring back um, Call of Duty Two, like Black Ops Two or something like that. Yeah, the zombies, where you're running in the field. Like anybody that's played Call of Duty's played that one. Oh yeah. Like I, I love that one, dude. I played that one so much with friends back in the day. 360 no scoop. Hmm. Yeah, I've seen some crazy stuff on YouTube, dude. Players that are just, they get these crazy shots. I don't know if you guys have ever, like, looked up videos on YouTube where, like, some of these, like, you you almost guess it, dude. You're like, is this, like, I don't know, like, is this person, like, using aimbot or something like that? Because you could have just done all some stuff and then just pulled the trigger and got, like, a headshot because you're using, like, some sort of aimbot or something like that. But I don't know.
You know, because aimbot exists in a lot of games. Like, almost every game, I'm pretty sure, has, like, some sort of aimbot. Yeah, we're just in PlayStation 5 here. We're chilling in a closed crew session. So if you're in the crew, you can come on through. Dude, they're using Cronus, Cronus Zens in DayZ. I saw in a lobby somebody got banned for using it. Yeah, so uh, a bunch of people were asking me if I could do another one of these for a little bit. So we're just chilling until it's time to go to the track. It's getting to be that time where it's like I'm, I'm debating on getting a telescope and like, like a camera that I can like, you know. Fo now, I haven't seen anything yet. We haven't seen anything yet necessarily this year, but like it's the summer is just here. Okay. And if anybody remembers from last year, any live streams or anything like that, I get back from doing uh, joggings and things like that freaking... I see crazy things sometimes in the, in the night sky. Like, is it what is that? Is that a plane? How come it ain't making noise? Mm -hmm. Planes make noise, dude. You can hear like a plane from super far away. Okay, they have big jet engines on them and stuff. They they're really loud. Yeah. I mean, I just like to capture one potentially. You know, then I, would I be like a UFO? I'll just start like a UFO hunting channel. Mm -hmm. That's why. I, that's why I just go out like every night dedicated <clears throat> dedicated ufo hunter the only problem is like where i live too it's all the uh what do they call it they call it light light pollution <laughs> oh yeah polluted polluted by the light so you can't see necessarily the night sky as much as you'd want to and besides dude you'd want like something to like magnify things i think like a telescope or something like that i see some bright things in the sky sometimes like what is that man i just, like i was always debating on getting like a telescope what is that where did the moon go the moon was just here okay i was gonna look this up because sometimes the moon ain't even out man it's not even out at all you're like where did it go they, so, they hey, turned off the lights and then i look up some some stuff on the internet and they're talking about some crazy things like the moon's not even the moon, the moon's like a spaceship or something like that, where the aliens live on the backside of it, with stuff like that. And they got pictures so, and everything. Uh, what's your percentage going to be for the um, eclipse? What? The eclipse that's happening on the eighth. Wait, there's a there's a what? Dude, I like don't yeah. even know what's going on with life. I think there's I didn't like even know the other day was yeah, Easter. Yeah, they're saying. I didn't know yet. Yesterday was Easter. There's there's an there's an eclipse that's supposedly happening. Supposedly, there's a lot of shit going to be going down on Monday, man. It's like some weird eclipse. Here in uh, Illinois, we're going to have a total 100% eclipse. Uh, yeah, I don't I don't know. You, I, don't, I, I know at one point, though, have, we like... did have an eclipse here, and it was like the best because of where I live or whatever like that a while, uh, a few years, a few years ago, you know, um, we, we did have an yeah. eclipse, and it was like... It was so weird. It was so weird. The the light spectrum, the light spectrum was so like it was different. Like everything was just so orange. Like everything, and it was like it's not the normal of like what your you know your perception is. And and it's it's crazy. It was kind of scary. I'm just glad that it like went away too. I I got those eclipse uh, glasses and stuff like that too. We got those mm -hmm. over here. So yeah, it's supposed to be like really crazy. Like this this one is like. Supposedly, like, I don't know, there's a lot of lure about, about this one that's going around. Conspiracy theories? A lot. A lot. Huh, maybe I'll have to dive into it and check it out. That's why I wish we a could grave. do some other things on the <laughs> a, channel, a, you know what I'm saying? A like, grave. Yeah? A grave. A lot. Yeah, a lot of stuff. Okay. You need an invite <laughs> over here, dude? Looks like it's just me and one other person for right now. Yeah, it's uh, t Tuesday, I think. Tuesday evening. Just decided to do a quick live stream here. Okay, that's crazy. I'm just telling you, dude. They Listen, they, they've already done like tons of stuff with the moon, potentially. All right, alien base on the backside of it. We don't know. Hollow with like tons of tunnels. Alien base inside, potentially. And then at one point, too, they were talking about in this one thing that I was researching, saying that like there's no recorded history of like the moon being here for for like ever you know what i'm saying I'm like oh well, of course because they're saying like a meteor supposedly hit earth and then like the moon is supposedly a chunk of the earth or something and you're like okay well i don't know about all that but 
they did do a ping test at one point too. You could look that up, like the ping test. They did it two times too. Just hurled, hurled something right into the moon, and there was like a ping test. So like I don't know, because one of the one of the theories is like aliens brought the moon here so the moon could balance out like you know the weather and and stuff here on earth like the ocean because the oceans were crazy back in the day before the moon because you know how the moon like has things to do with the tide and you know what i'm saying like gravitational pulls and other things like that but i'm not a scientist i'm just saying how are we supposed to know all this stuff anyways you just get fed all this information you're like okay hey I, I still think I have one of the best conspiracies when it comes to the moon. You're like, how are we supposed to know the sun is hot? <laughs> Has anybody I been agree. to the sun and and confirmed this <laughs> that it's hot? I, that it's hot. I, I, I agree. So we live in a in a universe where everything in its mother has a rotation, right? Everything. So everything floating in space, garbage, everything has a rotation to it, right? Why are we looking at the same picture of the moon since the first picture of the moon? Yeah, there's a good one there. There's a lot of conspiracies out there, I'm telling you. Are we being like, fed the right information or is it easy to deceive people? It's like really like look at every picture of the moon that you ever seen in your life. Pull up any picture and look at the moon itself. It's the same same side of it, same everything. Well, here's what they're here's what they're saying too. Yo, well, yeah, it's it's stationary. It doesn't it doesn't like spin. It spins with it does spin, but it spins with as we spin. So there's always like a backside of it. That's all. There's all. That's why they call it the the dark side of the moon. You know, Pink Floyd made a freaking album talking about. Well, I don't know if they were talking about it, but they referenced the dark side of the moon. Well, and well, that doesn't make sense. That that means that other sides of the planet should have different pictures of the moon. You would think, but the moon doesn't spin. <laughs> the moon spins but, with us. That's that. I know. I don't have the best of vision, but at nighttime, if you if you like look like really close at the moon, you can actually see like craters in it. I, I was told. But I think you need like a telescope. I would definitely need a telescope. So that's another thing too that they were talking about. So the like the craters in the moon have been measured, and like they're all the same depth. So what does that say? That means that, like, potentially the ping test is real, and the moon is really made out of, like, some metal or something. Mm -hmm. Some sort of metallic, some sort of metallic material. Yeah, you guys, we're clo uh, closed crew session, I, I think. Hold on. Yep, crew session. Crew session here on PlayStation 5. We got the neon over here. It's an electric car. It runs on push, push, Flintstone push power. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if I've ever seen one of those before in a game. Possibly. I can imagine. I can imagine that somebody at one point has modded a Flintstones car over here. Oh, oh. yeah. PC? Yeah, I'm PC. Like, the Flintstones car. And, like, the only thing that, like, drives it is, like, them just <laughs> oh, <foot laughs> scurrying, in their, scurrying in their feet or something. On... What's up, Mr. Frost? Yeah, we're just chilling for a bit. I didn't know if anybody wanted to come through and get any modded cars, potentially. Maybe get this going for a little bit. Get some modded cars. The modded cars. Binnies. Dude, I still got lots of room. Lots of money. Looking for, looking for the modded cars. Just one or two of them. Are they gonna have anything like this in GTA 6? Are we gonna be able to trade? Are we gonna be able to trade like this? Or they gotta have something, right? At some point, if they look, oh, if yeah. they look at the numbers and see like how many people are chilling at the LS car meet, it's gonna be a lot. Ooh, I I think um not 100% full, but I'm pretty sure you can still get a, like an invisible body. I don't know the process though. Uh, the glitch that I know has has to deal with the transfer glitch, and you, like, I think it's the belt or something that doesn't disappear, so it's, look, you just look like a belt running around, basically. <laughs> oh, yeah, let me get that link for the crew, dude. Sorry.
got a contract here. Find that find that link. All right, so this link should work. Uh, as soon as I put that in there, I'm going to test it, though. Looks like it is working. Yeah, so that's crazy that there's an eclipse or something like that. On the, Does anybody know what time? Or maybe I could just look at this. Um, maybe I'll just look here, it up and figure it out. Yeah, here it's at like starts at like 12, 12.30. So you would probably be like 10, 10.30. Yeah, something like that. So it's going to be in the morning time. So I got to make sure that I'm yep. up and awake and stuff like that. But yeah, dude, I'm telling you, the last eclipse that we had, it was just so... I can't describe it. It's weird. It's like... It's not even being on planet Earth anymore or something like that. And just imagine that there's probably places like out there and like their spectrum of light is not like our spectrums of light. And it changes everything, dude. It's, it's so weird. I don't know. I just can't explain it. It's just weird. It just doesn't look like you're, it just doesn't even feel like you're on planet Earth anymore. Like you're on a, like, you're like an alien planet or something because the light spectrum is. At least, at least for me where I live, it was like super orange. Like everything was like super orange and kind of like wavy or something too. It like had like a waviness to it that was really weird. Like I, like a blurriness. I don't know, man. Eighty one left the crew. That's fine, man. People, people don't have to. I'm not twisting anybody's arm to Munson. <laughs> Tw twist your arm to Munson. <laughs> All right, somebody put up the uh, I need a hero flag over here in uh, zombies. Yeah, who knows, dude? Eclipses are cool, though, so everybody's going to see it then, potentially. That's going to... That's... What if I should videotape it? Should I videotape it and do, like, a, a, a live streaming? All right, there's this gravesite. We're in the we're in the very middle of the of the eye of the storm, <laughs> the eclipse right now. Now this is supposed to last for a good thirty seconds. I hear. Why are you yelling? <laughs> <laughs> it's really it's really loud. This eclipse. This eclipse is is emitting a lot of sound. Yeah, I should at least, dude. I don't have like a necessarily good recording device, but it, just use my phone. <laughs> Phones are pretty decent. What do you got over here, dude? What are you rocking? Rocking sockin' robots? <laughs> With F1s. Got the F1s on there. I think it is F1s. Uh, I don't know. It was a guess. I told Solar to get in here, too. He's got cars that I needed to buy off of him. He's, like, done with GTA. I'm pretty sure he deleted it. <laughs> He's like, I'll meet you in GTA 6. There was like an echo with it too because he's walking away. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> That's fine. I'll be in GTA 6. I'm just I'm just making sure that we I we're finishing up GTA 5. The captain is going down with the ship, but I'm getting on a dinghy and we're going to GTA 6. Saying goodbye to, to GTA 5 at the What, next year? I'm pretty sure by next year. <laughs> <laughs> This is it. This is our last year in GTA. Everybody say your goodbyes. No, I do actually plan. Um, right before GTA 6 drops, I'm going to do another, probably another live streaming of playing GTA 5 here. Going through the story because it's worth it. It's really, it's a really funny story too. It's like Trevor, Trevor and Lamar are like two of the most funniest characters in GTA 5. Oh, they don't have these doors open over here. Not a whole lot, just chilling, Josh. Are you want to come through here? We're just, uh, we got a small amount of people at this time. We can hopefully get some more cars in here. I can, uh, I got more, uh, I have more modded cars too. I'll call them in in a second, but we want to get some more people in here. This live stream just got started about nine minutes ago or something, as it says. Maybe longer than nine minutes. So you got those purple flippers on your feet there. That's good. So just in case you have to go swimming in the water, you don't have to put on a scuba suit and you can just stay in the water forever, huh? All right.
You know, that's why I, dude, I read some stuff on Twitter where people were actually like talking trash about GTA 6's graphics because they were like supposedly comparing with the leaked footage, but like the leaked footage is from like 2020 or something like that that they're comparing it to. So you can't tell me that like they're not going to do like, you know, texturing and things like that to make it like, dude, look at the. Yeah, but did we actually did we actually get to see any gameplay for GTA 6's trailer or was it all cutscenes? Was that all cutscenes? Or did we actually get to see any type of it looked like all cutscenes to me. I don't know. I don't know if I actually seen any gameplay in there. What's up, Killer? Manila? But ain't a fan Killa. of Fulfilla? What's up, Killer? Killer right now is currently working on a barn that he can that oh, he can work boy. on his trucks. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I, I just see that one out there. Hmm. Build a barn. You can then you can lock the door. Don't let anybody in. You just get to work on your trucks, listen to good music, and drink some cold beers. <laughs> Forget about the world. <clears throat> just for one day. Uh, we don't know the PSN, dude. My PSN is like a temp right now, so you can just join the crew and then join the crew session. Yeah, I'll bust out some more modded cars in a second. Yeah, we got purple. We got purple nurple over here with the purple flounder flippers. So when you walk on the sand, you make duck print, duck prints. Mm -hmm. Is that like, is that a glitch that we're going to see in GTA 6? How to get scuba flippers <laughs> <laughs> or something <laughs> kind of character. Got those scuba flippers, man. That's awesome. Oh, he's got flippers on everything. <laughs> oh, hold on now. We got more cars coming in here. Yo, what is this? Convertible. The Converti. I don't even know what that is, though. The windows are rolled up or something. So that's like kind of like... Yeah, I think the windows are rolled up. I wonder if that's going to be an option, too, that we're going to be able to do. Like, can I roll my window down instead of, like, just, like, using my elbow to break it and and shoot? Like, some of the mechanics are a little bit questionable, you could just say, in this game. Like, how come I got to break my break the window in some cars, but in an armored Karuma, there is no window to break. You can just, I don't know, mm -hmm. you're just shooting out through one of those little peepholes. Oh, you got your truck fixed. Nice. Good deal, buddy. Truck is fixed. I've got a bike is over he here. Rolling coal. Yeah, we still got the sovereign coming in. I, th I believe. I don't know what else besides the sovereign, but I know that they're probably not going to drop anything until 420. And Turp, I don't know if you've seen what we have going on for 420, but it's basically, I think, what we're getting like a base a baseball. I mean, well, just the stuff with the marijuana oh, yeah. uh, to it. I it's just the baseball it. cap and two t-shirts. It's never been <laughs> anything too special, you know. They don't care. Like, why don't they? Why don't they do something cool, dude? Like, bring in, bring in a tally character or something. <laughs> mm -hmm. You gotta, you gotta go find the bags of weed. No, there's already a thing where you had to go find bags of weed, dude. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah. To yeah. get like the T-shirt and something else, it's like 50 bags of weed or something. You have to, you have to go find. I can't remember what it is. It's one of the, it's one of the collectible things though. Oh, you can hear other people? Other people are talking? Yeah, I'm in a party chat right now with one of my friends. The reason the reason that I do this, too, is because I noticed that when I'm in a party, it makes the vocals, the sound quality, like, way better. Yeah, it isolates the voice chat instead of the game sounds and all that crap. Yeah. I think that's what it does. You don't notice it until, like, you, you leave a party and then everything's like... <sighs> or something like that it's like a cat like a cat hissing at you or something sometimes you're just like ah what's going on besides you if you play gta long enough at some point you'll probably just make the right decision and just stop listening to a lot of other people's 
Like everybody, everybody, dude. Like you go into a public session. I'm telling you, it's always the same thing. Same three. You got people arguing, being racist. You got some little kid asking for a ride, even though the game is called Grand Theft Auto, and those cars like right in front of you, you can just steal one and like use it. Yeah, another thing too I'd say is just people listening to music. That's that's like one of the biggest things that I hear on GTA when I choose to listen to anybody. They're just like they're just at their house. They're listening to loud music and they're playing they're and they're playing yeah. GTA. You're just like, how come or you're playing GTA and listening to loud music? Right, because I like to party. I party hard or here. Somebody screaming. House. In <laughs> okay, it's nothing but loud music and GTA. I don't want to hear people. That's why I got my music loud. <laughs> Oh, you're on Xbox One, dude. That's a that's a specific request too for a car. No, I don't I don't know because I'm not on Xbox. And honestly, dude, if I had like my big channel, I'd probably have like a setup out in my living room or something right now that had like multiple multiple stuff. It's just uh, you know, you lose the big channel, you lose the revenue that goes with it to help you like grow your channel. Be like Mr. Mr. Beast, like use all of his, all of his money to back into his channel that's always something i wanted to do too i wanted to find like a really good artist and like have them make like 10 10 great gravesite designs or something like that like give them like maybe some ideas and then just have them just like whatever you know yeah isn't there a merge glitch working right now i think is that a heard Yeah, you think so? I don't I don't like him. I can tell you that much right now. I don't like him. <laughs> I like him as much as I like PewDiePie. Not much at all at all. <laughs> like cool, you have a hundred hundred plus million subscribers. Well, at least one thing that we knew that PewDiePie did is donate his money a, a whole bunch. Like all the time. He'd donate. Somebody. That's at least one thing, good thing. That's a lot of things that you don't see from like YouTubers, like them actually showing proof that they're like donating a big chunk of their money to oh, why do you pop? Can kids that have cancer or something, you know? PSN, we're not quite sure what the PSN is. I'm a, I'm a temp right now until I change it to something. People are like, what was it before? I think it was gravesite underscore YT. And that, it won't let me change it back to that because some sort of infraction. Somebody spammed reported me. I don't, I don't, I don't do anything like on the microphone. Like I just talk about aliens or we were talking earlier about the eclipse that's going to be happening supposedly on April 8th. That's going to be trippy. I was thinking about recording that too. I should at least probably record it and do like some commentary or something and post a video. Hey guys, it's me Graveside. This is the eclipse. Are you on planet earth too right now? You look, you're probably experiencing hey Jay, look at me stealing all their kills. <laughs> third party no i'm over here uh standing on a beach uh, umbrella just stealing all the kills of the zombies someone tried to group group them up oh no there's uh three other people here but the gun i'm using is a it's a one tap on the zombies so i keep flicking over you know to lock onto the heads because i have dead uh, dead shot so they're trying to kill the zombies, and I'm just standing up on this umbrella, just headshotting all of them. Does anybody need anybody here? No? Yeah, it's just, it's so sad, dude, the way that things went over here, too. I wish we had zombies in GTA. I think if you want, the most extent, if you want to play zombies, you have to go to PC and, like, download a mod or something like that. Yeah. There's a lot, of, there's a lot of immersiveness that, that you can actually do too, like in GTA, like when it comes, when it comes to like getting gas for vehicles, you have to eat food and drink water to like survive. It, it reminds me of DayZ in a sense, or, or basically because DayZ came out about the same time as GTA five is it makes me think that like, um, modders, whoever, who like made the zombie, um, program or modding, whatever it is, you know what I'm saying? Files and probably, probably ripped it off from DayZ or something like that.
well, at least other survival games where you have to drink water, you have to eat food. Yeah. But DayZ is a bit different too because man, you get a you get a, a hole in your boot, <laughs> you're gonna start <laughs> getting cut or something like that, and you think your friend's hat or your friend's witch hat is cursed him and, <laughs> and that was cutting cutting you somehow so it was i mean the lot that was the only logical uh, thing this guy's this guy's laying it down with some real paranoia <laughs> you can't buy lost land vans here dude you should get that out of here what is this is this even modded bro Or like some people come through here and they don't even have modded cars. They just bring like a regular one or something. They're like, is it okay if I don't have any modded cars? Yeah, you can get some modded cars potentially. This is kind of nice right here. I like that. Oh, I think I know this. You need an invite here, dude? You in the session? Yeah, I'm not I'm not doing this for like three, four, or five hours tonight. It's Tuesday. We got uh more stuff potentially happening. Uh might I was thinking about doing a daisy. <clears throat> I'm, I'm like, I almost get games confused sometimes. Like Daisy's DMZ, DMZ is gone gone. Mm -hmm. Days gone, Days gone, which is Days oh, yeah. Gone is a really good video of uh, zombie game. It's not online though. Yeah, right here, dude. I don't know my PSN, but you have to just join just join the crew and then join the session. Here, I'll show you I'll show you it too. Um I was gonna go into cruise right here. And like all these people right now, you could join any one of these people. So if I just went into the crew, there's mine right there. So it's like temp dash one two two four five four five three four four five six like eight nine or something. It's a big old number. Supposedly I went to PlayStation Jail, and then that's that's the number they issued me when you go to PlayStation Jail. Did I catch a niner? What's up, dude? Nothing, just chilling. It's Tuesday. Uh, just wanted to do a live stream thing for a little bit. <clears throat> yeah, supposedly there's a lot of conspiracies going on with the eclipse, aliens, man made, flat earth. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't believe any of the flat earth stuff. It's it's fun to indulge in a lot of conspiracies. It, it, just because I listen and, and like I'm interested in a conspiracy or something like that doesn't mean that I necessarily believe in it, you know. It's another thing too. A lot of, there's a lot of fun things out there to like man, it wouldn't be crazy if this was actually real and like maybe it could be real. It could be real though cuz we don't know. For all we know, fairies fairies fart reality and we're living in fairy fart dust <laughs> we don't know i'm just uh, fairy fart dust. i'm just just throwing that one out there makes you hallucinate reality <laughs> am i gonna be near the solar eclipse what does that mean for all on what does that mean we're all on planet Earth. We're all gonna be near it, I think. How am I, how am I gonna be more near yeah, than you? Unless, I, unless I'm on like Mount Everest or something. The, but the way they line up, Grave, you gotta understand. There's a set path that it goes through, right? So what and what's eclipsing, the, anyways? Is it the moon or is it a planet or what's going on here? It's 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 the moon. But oh, it's, it's the, the moon path, again. Okay, so it's another moon but eclipse. It, but but it's the path that it goes through. Well, I, do you know another planet that goes in front of the moon? earth <laughs> <laughs> but it's but okay it's the path that it's it's going down this okay this yeah way. i understand 
I got it's you. No, I get it. I get it. I get it. It's, because it's, yeah, because last uh, no, last solar intersect- eclipse that that we in, had, I I live in the place where it was like the absolute best place to to witness. That's why I was telling you guys it was no, so the, weird. It, the, the Wait, it was so weird when I was here because I was like the closest. Because I was the closest to it. Yeah. The, the conspiracy is the path. The path that it's going in. It's can it's intersecting with a previous path. Well, what's and it's like, what's the path anyways pro- across so, the supposedly states? it's a where's, prophecy. Where's, it, where's the peak? Um, I know it's like say it's like like uh, Los Angeles or something. It's no, it's on the East Coast, uh, north, north and south, like all the way straight up, like it's like northeast to southeast, because we're getting a hundred percent here. Going to be a hundred percent total eclipse here. Yeah, I know what an eclipse is. You guys, I'm not asking what it, what is an eclipse. I'm just asking what's the best, what was the best, jeez. Like, I haven't been to school. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they teach you about eclipses in, sc- in school. <laughs> yeah, it's where the moon blocks the blocks the sun. Back in the day, I, I've learned, too, that, like, they used to think some real crazy things back in the day, dude. You know? Like, old old-time gods and... Aries or whatever his name is, the sun god. There's a lot of other sun gods and just like Aries and stuff like that because there's Ra, like the Egyptian Egyptian sun god. Stand over here in the light. What's up, space monkey? Looks like you're back here from space. He was in space and now he's back in Los Santos. All right. Good deal. What do we got here? What do we got here? Are you thinking about buying it? You're just standing next to it and you're thinking about it? You're looking at the price? And you're like, I don't know. <laughs> you like the color? I, I like those rims, though, the Benny rims. They're like the lightning bolt ones. Those are like some of my favorite. You need an invite over here, dude? Yeah, I'll, I'm going to do this for a little bit tonight. Not, not forever, though, because we still have lots more of these to... To get to at some point. Yeah, that's my neon right there. Hey, I kind of like this. What's this? It's great. Hey, man, I was looking at that. I was, I was a potential buyer. Yeah, I was thinking about buying that because it was green. Mm-hmm. All the best things are green, okay? I'm telling you. Money. Weed. Tattooed women. (laughs) (laughs) How do you join? You just gotta join the crew, my dude. Bing, bang, boom. Right there. This is gonna be my last game of zombies for tonight. Shit. You guys don't think that anything bad is going to happen during the eclipse, though, do you? Like They're saying a ton of shit's supposed to go wrong. <laughs> so I'm telling you, Grave. <laughs> do you do you what do you think is going to happen? Like a nuclear like a nuclear thing or I don't know, but like spa- like, like a spaceship it's, invasion? Yeah, it's it's all over the news. Like like, like Bigfoot's revealing himself? I don't know. I, Loch Ness I monster can one. actually fly or Yeah, just give me two seconds here. I'll call out another car. We're just trying to we're just trying to like figure out what's going on with the eclipse here. Trying to get some some more information out of you guys, so I don't have to look it up myself. Now is it a conspiracy? Blood sacrifices? That... Is there going to be That's blood it. sacrifices? <laughs> is it? Oh, I bet you. I bet you. There's some satanic <laughs> stuff probably going on. They're like, ooh, some some solar eclipse <laughs> thing or something. We gotta. We gotta get some chickens. <laughs> now is it a coincidence the new Ghostbusters movie just came out? Yeah, I watched the new Ghostbusters movie, and let me just tell you something. The new one where they're in New York, the one that just came out. No, no, no they're not in New. They're not in New York. They're in like Antarctica or something. Yeah, the new Frozen no. one or something that just yeah, literally yeah. just came out. Like just well, it's, just came it's, out. It's New York. It's still you know. Yeah, but it's like they're yeah. in like Frozen something. They go to Antarctica or something. No, they don't. <laughs> I swear to God, I, well, I don't know. I wouldn't no, know. No, the, like... the, 
I the, 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 the ghost, bad. the ghost, the ghost freezes New York. Oh, okay. Is that why it looks like Antarctica or something? Jeez, you said you watched it. <laughs> I watched not the whole thing. You... <laughs> Bits and pieces, maybe. Oh, my God. The whole premise is like they're back in New York. Uh, they're, back in the old fire... they're back in the old firehouse. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not dealing with it. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that. None of that new Ghostbusters is good, dude. It's not. Like, ever since, like, Ghostbusters 3, it's just gone downhill to me. Who are, who are these people? We don't know them. They, these are Ghostbusters? Dude dude on there is, like, 14 years old. 14-year-old. Ghostbuster? Come on now. Really? Why why are you a monkey in here? There's a monkey. There's, there's a tag of the Planet of the Apes. Terp, there's a monkey in here. <laughs> No, I'm serious. Like one of those one monkeys. Hey. The space monkey? No, like a little monkey. <laughs> There's oh, a little okay. monkey in here. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How are you a little monkey? Is that gender swap or something, dude? <laughs> Seriously, what is that? <laughs> that's funny. That's probably about the funniest character that's ever came through here is a little monkey. <laughs> now, does he have an emote? You got an emote? You got an emote, monkey? Monkey, can you emote? Emote, monkey. So if that's working, I wonder if... Um, director mode is working. Uh, it's, a, it's a glitch where I believe that you can... Uh, you can get characters from director mode and you can bring them to online. Well, that's what I'm saying. If that's unpatched, then that's like I don't. The main, I don't. That's think the that, main part of it. <laughs> I don't think that you can get the random, the random stuff though. I think I think it has to deal with the. Uh, yeah, there's got to be certain ones that aren't like majorly blacklisted. I don't know. Like I'll, I'll look into it later though. Yeah. The fact that dude tell, came in tell here. Tell him to go in there is Trevor. <laughs> so that's that's not a a, a display of. Uh, coolness unless you're coming in as trevor yeah back in the day when you could when you could do that too we used to roll around yeah. a whole bunch uh michael was one of the characters that i you know you'd want to be a character that people as soon as they seen you they'd be like hey wait a minute <laughs> you know it, it's either or it's michael franklin or trevor usually we'd roll if there was enough of us we everybody would be one of them you get like into a car since mm -hmm. we didn't have the voices you know to back it up that's what I don't understand about freaking, yeah, like what my friend Terp here brought up too. Like for Ned Luke's character, like an actual GTA, how come like GTA Rockstar didn't let him play as his character? Like there's yeah, glitches yeah, yeah. that we've done and potentially do now that allow us to play as like story mode characters or whatever. Like, I don't know. Yeah, the monkey's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know what other characters necessarily are in there. Um, there's a well, there's a bunch. There's a bunch of characters. You guys have never been in director mode and looked at like a lot of the characters. A lot of, of the characters course. though, you can actually unlock course, by playing. Of course, he's gotta come in as a too. monkey and hump you. So you you actually unlock a lot of the characters too, but yeah, by playing story mode and going to these certain locations and things like that. I wonder if it'll be the same thing for like GTA Six or something. How like how immersive are they gonna make that storyline? Like, probably pretty deep, dude. I can imagine I'm going to be playing story for a long time. I'll probably I'll probably still be playing story when online comes out. I'll have, like, two different lives. I'll have, like, a story, a story life and a freaking, like, an online life. $100 million first week. Let's go. <laughs> you think Michael is, huh? Michael's a pretty good character, yep. Yeah. You know, do you know who the most popular is though? It's Franklin, honestly. I've done I've done polls and asked people who's who's your favorite character and people was like it, the big numbers are always leaning towards Franklin for some reason. Cuz there are younger people that are saying it. But I'm just saying too, like man, does anybody even listen to anything coming out of Trevor's mouth?
Michael tried to get away from it. He couldn't. The monkey! The monkey in here! Yeah, I'm gonna look up that glitch and see what the uh, see what dealio is about it. It was something that I, uh, one of my friends text, or wrote me something on Twitter. I skimmed over the information and I was like, ah, you know, I don't know. I'd have to, I'd, I'd like have to look into it. Oh, really? You got to make a new account when you do that? What? Really? No, that sucks. That wouldn't be worth it then, potentially. Maybe maybe do it like on an on an old old account or something like that. But if you have to make a new account every time that you do that, oh no way, dude. <laughs> if you had a choice, Franklin would have to be killed. <laughs> yeah, because you don't because there's never a choice in there. It's either it's either you're killing Trevor, you're killing Michael. Or you're killing Devin or something like that. And I've seen all I've seen and I've chosen all of the all the endings. So you get to see like all the endings. I don't I do not like the one where Trevor dies. I really you know, that was brutal. Lights him on fire and stuff and it's horrible. Then what was that one too? What's the ending? I'm pretty I'm pretty sure it's uh it's Franklin and Michael and they're on the they're on the tower or something like that and then Franklin like decides to drop Michael. Yeah. I think right. he drops him or something like yeah, he drops him. And then we all know the best ending, which is let's kill Devin and no and none of the Because here's the thing though, when you kill a story character, you don't get to play as them anymore. Like if at mm. in game and story, like <laughs> as soon as you kill off one of them, you don't get to you don't get to play as them anymore, you know. And what right-minded individual would kill off one of the story mode characters, or you don't get to play as them anymore? There's actually a lot of stuff to do for uh, awards and things like that. This is also something that I did religiously in like Red Dead Redemption. Is um, I play that story. I played like Red Dead story a whole bunch, man. I got a lot of the stuff done in story mode, all the achievements and rewards and all that stuff like that. Yeah, because I'm a nerd like that. I like to go after things sometimes. I'm just like screw it. I just want to see. I just want to see if it's a challenge and it's out there. You know what I'm saying? I want to see if I can do it. Sometimes. Same thing with the challenges right now in GTA. You know? What are people bringing in here for vehicles? We got a bubble bubble gum. What's it got? Money liveries on it? Uh, that's nothing too special. Because I think you can just put money liveries on that. Money livery is probably the rarest. Just because I don't think there's a merge that you can do with it. The only way to get money is you you have to do like an actual. Tr mm. uh, yeah. There's no transfer for it either. What do we got here? A G car or what? What's up with this? What are those? I can't even tell. Bennies? Some Bennies? I've seen this one before. I got that one. That's like the, uh, I don't know. Not the the Blues Brother mobile. That was like an old Pontiac, freaking nineteen, <laughs> super old. Mm -hmm. That's that's like back when the cars that they made. You get hit by an old by like an old school car, dude. It would demolish a new school car for real. They weighed no, heavier. They, They're no, probably like they, welded they, with they, more steel and other stuff they, like that. They, they tested that a long time ago. I watched a video in one of my uh, automotive classes when I was uh, younger. And it's sure not no. what you would think. It's nope. You the new car, the new cars are made to crumble in on themselves. Yeah, they are. So like head on collision, it was a Chevy and a Chevy, old school Chevy, new school Chevy. And the old school Chevy, the steering column took the dummy's head off. Oh. And the dashboard took the upper body away after that. But then on the new Chevy, n dashboard never moved. Isn't there a video game where they have that? Like some sort of simulator or something like that? Crash test? Uh, yeah, Beam and G. Beam something, and G something like that. You can, just test, yeah. you can just test things. That sounds like a fun video game. He's like, all right, let's 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 take a tank and, and, and crash <laughs> it up against a... a 
Godzilla. <laughs> right. Yeah, they came out with like a new Godzilla and King Kong movie. Yeah, watched, Dude, it's so CG'd. It. It's ridiculous. Yeah, it is. I've, I watched some of it and I was like, I'm out. <laughs> it's a ridiculous story anyways. How many times are you gonna bring back King Kong, dude? And Godzilla. They've been fighting for a hundred years now at least. Well, King Kong, he's older now, man. He had like white hair in his beard. Yeah, he had a he had an old tooth or something that had to get replaced too, so yeah. they did that. Then he had uh, a Thanos gauntlet. I don't I didn't get that far into the movie. I didn't. Yeah, they give him like a. Uh, it's just like the the new Ghostbusters guy. movie. I just don't make it into too far into some movies that just can't capture me. Like, like mm -hmm. they, I don't know. Like watching Ghostbusters one. That's probably like one of the best Ghostbusters. Like, come on, they. That's when like they they get together. That's when like the whole creation of Ghostbusters. You're like, when is that though? That's like 1986. Mm -hmm. This little monkey's still here. <laughs> I don't think you, I don't think the monkey has any emotes, and I don't think the monk. Yeah, you can't jump in here either. It sucks. Let's take away their jumping ability in the LS car meet. Same with every other building. They don't need to jump in buildings. Will we be able to jump in buildings in GTA 6? We'll put a we'll put a pin in that one. Hey, we actually got a lot of people coming through here. Right on. You guys got some good modded vehicles? I would like to buy them, please. I just don't want to make sure that I have too many cut and copies of like too many of the one of one vehicle. There's like 18 Zinternos. <laughs> Nine cop cars. All right, here, I'll bust out another one. I was going to call out one of the modded cars from, what is it, the auto shop. What you need, boss? Some wheels? I can bring them around. Get away from me. Uh, this one right here I got from my friend Turp. This is the, uh, the HKR. It's coming at you. I'll get back to it then. You you drive that truck right there in the snow. You're you're never gonna be able to go much anywhere, because mm -hmm. this is the most driftiest truck in the game, I think. That's what kind of made me mad a little bit too with like the the new drift the drift races because like we can't necessarily take our drift vehicles in there can we not not all of them that are meant to, that are meant to be drift like for the low rider or the the low grip stuff that came in with the auto shop it's supposed to be like here's your guys's new system of drifting is those is those low grips that's like why they brought in low grips i can't stand low grips too by the way horrible uh wheel <clears throat> All right, let's give this guy the ability to feel like he's driving on snow when he's not. Yeah, right there. That's another thing too that we were that we were talking about. So yeah, there is there most likely is going to be snow in Florida, even though it doesn't snow in Florida. It doesn't snow really in Los Angeles either. So like you have one person like it snows and it snowed in Los Angeles and. 1992 like yeah okay cool 20 years ago you got like two inches <laughs> i live in a place where it snows man i can live in the mountains okay don't make me bring up my my ice my ice storm 10 <laughs> days 10 days of no internet and five days of no electricity freezing my ass oh man it was horrible. We're getting more prepared though Ooh. these days. So every single time that like I go and I get stuff, I'm I'm I, I swear to God I'm getting things for potentially the end of the world. Whether it's more candles or more bullets. <laughs> you gotta be you gotta be prepared. 
about a hundred dollars worth of canned canned corned beef hash. <laughs> <laughs> if you put the if you put the can in the fire, you gotta watch out though. You gotta usually pop pop, pop a little hole, hole in, in it. it. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, those, <laughs> those things can like explode. Trust me. Oh, you do got the emote. Oh, you got the yeah, but yeah, but you got the one emote. That's that's all you have. <laughs> <laughs> little monkey, little monkey. Don't do that. Don't don't do that, monkey. Don't don't play with yourself, okay? <laughs> hey, green joggers. All right. Got the green joggers, huh, buddy? I invented green joggers. Did you know that? <laughs> it was me. There was every other every other color until I told Rockstar, like, hey, can you make those green joggers just for me? They're like, sure. Mm -hmm. We can do that. No problem. Make that happen. You're, like, looking like an FBI agent over here or something. Are you an FBI agent? Why you got a rebreather on? You like that one dude from GI Joe's Co Cobra Commander? <laughs> Can't breathe, right? Something happened. You like you like the Joker? You got pushed into a big vat of acid. No monkey, no monkey. <clears throat> Bad monkey. Yeah. What is it too? So, like, we live in the world where we don't spank the monkey, but the monkey spanks us. He's <laughs> so, I mean, all so we don't know. They could have a whole army of monkeys spanking. I can't, yeah, I can't remember. Monkeys. The funniest part of that little bit though is because they actually had like two monkeys dressed up as Jay and Bob chilling yeah. like outside of something. Oh yeah. That was the best that. part of that bit. I was like, I can't believe that they got two monkeys to do that. It was fucking hilarious. Yeah, we're on the PS5 right now. We're on the PS5. Yeah, hardcore. Best thing to do is just send me a message, dude, and I can add you. Don't worry about the monkey, okay? Don't worry about the monkey. That makes me want to go watch Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back again. That's an old movie. <laughs> classic, though. Classic one, though. comedy. You got to start off with the first one, though. He's all, what the F is the Bob. internet? <laughs> or something. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, I watched the making of that movie, too. They, they, had, a, they had a fun time doing that. So here's two of them right here, then. It looks like. Are these the ones that I sold? These look like my cars. These are like the fastest cars in the game right here. These two right here. Yeah, fastest car in the game. Uh, there's a glitch that potentially allows you to bring in uh, characters from director mode. Does that mean that director mode outfit glitch is working? N no. And du dude said every single time that he's he's doing that, he's got to he's got to do a new account. So a brand new account. If you're going to do that glitch. So, no thank you. GTA 6 gets here, I'm telling you. I'm going to have one account, like, I'm not doing any glitches on. Like, I'm just going to straight. Because with the stuff that they're still, dude, they're still banning people. It's been like a month and a half now, and they're still banning people. People are still getting banned. I'm still getting comments and stuff on my videos. So I'm like, yeah, they just banned me. It's like, well, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. Don't buy modded accounts. You can't feel bad for getting banned when you have like a modded account, you know what I'm saying? With trillions of dollars and like seven oh I guess my bill my trillion dollars is gone now. <laughs> Boo hoo, the game's eleven years old. Let's let's let it go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the yellow car? Yeah, the yellow car is the fastest car in the game, dude. Looks like it's got a beefy engine in it though, huh? This is a wide body for sure. Look how wide this car is. 
Like, compare it. Dude, look how wide this car is compared to this freaking SUV over here. Well, I guess the F1s do make it look a bit wider. Yeah, a bit fatter with the F1s on here, probably. I don't care, dude. It's still the fastest. The only thing that sucks about it, it doesn't have, like, the best um, anything else besides, like, top speed, necessarily. Is it something I want to drive around in the streets of Los Santos? No. <laughs> I have a Mark II oppressor. Look at this. Why, why are your feet so messed up? Look at your feet, man. That's not how a monkey, monkey's foot looks like, is it? Oh, yeah, because they kind of have, like, like, for their feet, they have, like, thumbs, right? They have, like, monkeys have, like, yeah. thumbs for their feet, right? Yeah, <laughs> it looks like it. It looks like all their toes look like thumbs. Ah, dude, I've seen some horrific stories online, too, of, like, where people get attacked by chimpanzees and crazy things happen to them, and... Oh, they're strong, dude. They get their faces, yeah. like, ripped off and their fingers They'll bitten. Tear you apart. It's crazy. That's the whole expression of going ape shit. <laughs> 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 I'll wait, I'll wait. <laughs> I don't want to cause too much here, but I'm just saying. Yeah, looky here, we got ourselves a nice little posse. Everybody showing up. Thank you, thank you guys. Appreciate that. Tuesday, it's Tuesday night, April second, is it? Did everybody did everybody get through April first without getting pranked? Mm hmm. Cause I didn't. Like, I don't think anybody does. Like people texting me or something like that. Messages on Twitter. Hey, bro. I think uh, I think this glitch is working again. I probably got like ten messages from people saying I think that this glitch is working again. And I'm like, yeah, on April Fools. Ha ha. <laughs> I'm sure that on April Fools they just unpatched director mode, the the auto shop replay glitch, freaking uh, all this other crap that people were saying. I know that there's car duplication glitches that are working right now too, but like, what's the point, man? You can sell one. You can sell one car a day. <laughs> that's like, <laughs> that's what GTA Six is probably going to be like. Has anybody played Red Dead Redemption One? Okay, I, I seen I seen like an intro for it, and I noticed in the very very first of the, there's John John Marston, right? You got John Marston, and you got a car. There's a car. Like, clearly there's a car that they were lifting off of a boat in, like, Red Dead Redemption 1. So then Red Dead Redemption 2 is before, right? Is the before? Yeah. Is before any of that stuff happened. So, yeah, okay. So they went back even further with Arthur. So, like, what it was. So then if you played number two, then number one would probably potentially make more sense. Because I was thinking about playing number, like, playing number one. I don't, I don't have an Xbox controller, though, dude. For, like, on PC, you need to have, like, it, you don't have to. But the most compatible controller for video games on PC is an Xbox because Microsoft. Because yeah, because of the whole PC thing. You you would probably find that the Microsoft Xbox like a uh, new Xbox like X controller or something like that. I was thinking about buying one just so I could do things over here. Yeah, because this summer I'd like to do some more stuff here on like just more more just more stuff. It's not this. Like, trust me, it doesn't take me very long to, like, get through video games, you know? I'm, like, still pl still playing GTA V here. Come on. It's a lot of great games out there. Yeah, that, ri that Rise of the uh, Rise of the Ronin game? Yeah, I just ended up finishing and beating that game. It was, it was a pretty good game. Nice. It's another one of those Japanese-type games that people don't have. I, I like the culture and stuff like that. I think it's really cool. All right, cool, dude. I'll I'll answer your message here when we're done, and I'll uh, send you a friend request. I'll send you a friend request. Hey, hey, you can't show those. You can't show. You gotta cover those up. You got a t-shirt on. Mm -hmm. Got your chichis hanging out and everything. Probably running. How'd you get into the back of my truck? Are you authorized to be in the back of my pickup truck? How'd you get back here?
What do you mean you just ran up there? Oh, what? It'll let you just go up there. <laughs> I didn't know that. Ha 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 ha! Look at this. Look where I'm at. The trick is you gotta jump from car to car here. If somebody opened up their door, we did this the other day too. We tried to go from car to car here. They opened up their door, we could get like I could potentially go on the door. Open up that door right there. Whoever owns it. Can you stop playing with yourself, little monkey? It's disturbing. Yeah, you got women walking around with their chi-chis. Hanging out, and you got monkeys that are spanking their chickens. Yeah, they're spanking themselves, I guess. And spanking their chickens. <laughs> <clears throat> Beating a banana. Yeah, I really feel like these days you should just leave the Tesseract wheels alone. Like, don't try to put binnies or F ones on there. Yeah. Because no they're rare enough as it is. Car they, is they're be the better. only car in the game. There's like 417 cars in the game, and this is the only car that has light up wheels like that. It's ridiculous. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Honestly, I'd rather have the light up wheels. Yeah, I think they look better. Uh, what do I do? If the uh, if the game is rated M, then how come there's like so many? I don't know. I I swear to God, they sound like they're four years old. Like they just learned how to talk. That's how old <laughs> they sound. They they sound like they just learned how to talk, and like they they're like a year deep in talking. Four, five years old. I'm guessing. What parent buys GTA Five for like their five year old? Like, come on. And you don't even Parents test it? Like, you don't even test it as a parent room. yourself? Oh, I don't know anything about video games. Oh, like, whatever. Let's slide, the, let's slide the blame game here to something else because I don't know how to play video games in the year 2024. Does anybody realize at some point that, like, all the people that, like, weren't born... When like video games were around, they're they're gonna die at some point, man. That and that's what's crazy about how time keeps shifting and generations and stuff of like there's generations now that have that have they've only grown up on on like some of the best video games, okay? Like some of the best stuff. Like kids today, they're spoiled, I think, with the video games. I don't wanna get into how old I am. Let's just say I've been around for a minute, okay? I played a lot of games. Honestly, a, a game I wish I could go play again is I want to play Mario. Uh, Mario World, yeah, that's what it's called. It's for Nintendo, Nintendo sixty four. I don't know if anybody remembers that game, but that game was fun. Yeah, it was Mario World, dude, and it was like an actual like. I'm pretty sure it was like the mo it was the very first like three D. Mario world or something, but it was really cool though too dude because like you're in like this giant castle and then You got all these portals to like different worlds and things like that like the mushroom land and stuff like that and, Oh, like, wait, are you talking about Mario 64? Yeah, like Mar yeah Mario world on 64 yeah, it, I think it was just yeah, I know yeah with the uh, Yoshi and all that. Yeah, man. That was an awesome game. Oh, yeah That was like one of the best Mario's that I've ever I've ever played better than Mario like one 2d so those two two D graphics. Mm -hmm. No, it's not the same. And you think about it too. If it's not the same, then what it is now, then like it was just like maybe twenty years ago. And then it's not going to be the same in twenty years from what it is now. I'm telling you, people will be looking at these games that we're playing and be like, "Dude, I can't even believe." I'm. I don't know. I kind of feel that way when like GTA Six gets here. It's like I can't even believe I was able to play GTA Five when this is. How come this didn't come out sooner? <laughs> mm-hmm. Well, there's two there's two big reasons. 
Like during during an interview, they they asked Michael and Michael and Franklin to go. How come you think GTA Six isn't? Michael Michael replied saying, "Well, Ned replied saying it had a lot. Well, a lot had to do with COVID, which it actually did. That's what, like part of the reason too. Like like the same the same year that freaking COVID comes out, like PlayStation Five drops, and it's like it was really hard to get a PlayStation Five in the very beginning. Like you'd be lucky to find one, or even be on like a waiting list or something like that. Like checking your phone for notifications from like Walmart and Best Buy or something." When they got restocks or something, just you like go online That's and what I did, hopefully, hopefully get one. Well, yeah, I it got tough. it was rough. I got day, trying to get lucky. one of those. They're I, like they weren't and they weren't lucky. like regular price either. Like you wanted to get one, they're like a hundred, two hundred, three hundred dollars more than regular at the time. Because because they said the digital the digital version was like two ninety nine. You're like two ninety nine for a PlayStation Five. You're like I'm pretty sure. You know that that's in the budget. Yeah, I That's got not... extremely lucky. I got mine on first drop. Yeah, that is, that is pretty lucky. I, I remember I was one of those people that I um for a while. I mean, for a good minute, like I was uh, looking for one and I couldn't get one. There's a couple times where I had it in the cart. I'm telling you, there's a couple times I had it in <laughs> the cart, and then like on checkout, it's just gone. So like someone else was faster and filling something out or something than me. There was like. Yeah. They're going record speed or something. They're like that. Okay, name, uh, address, f uh, credit card number, faster than this guy or something. Like I don't get it. Like, come on, man. I had it in my cart. How are you gonna steal it out of my cart? Is that that's a thing? <laughs> like that's a thing. That yeah, apparently, that was a thing. Yeah, well, now think about it, dude. PlayStation 5 is how old? We're going on, like, four years now or something? Everybody's everybody's anticipating on the PlayStation 5 Pro. I don't... I'm, honestly, at this point, I don't know why it's not out yet. It, it probably has to do with timing or something like that. I think they're through some reports or something that I read that they, they did say that they are working on... Uh, PlayStation 6 or and stuff like that too like a PlayStation 5 Pro and like PlayStation 6 <clears throat> like things are just getting better and better and better potentially you know a but once helicopter. again that has to be that has to do with a lot of factors you have to you have to consider in you know availability technology pricing things like that you know uh, technology at the time And it's, it's some sort of law, and it's been going on since, like, the 1950s or something like that. Every six months, it's some sort of something law. It's, like, an actual thing. It's, like, it's it's not a prediction. It's not it's not a question. It's not a theory. It's fact, people, that every six months, we are doubling our computer speed. And it's been going on since, like, the 1950s or something like that. And you're like, well, how come I don't have a good computer? Because the military does, okay? they They have the budget for it. You know, they have, like, these computers these days that have, like, I don't know, crazy, crazy processing and computing. They have, like, computers that, like, literally tell you where where the next winning lottery ticket's going to be. But they can't use them to, for that. You, you understand? <laughs> these are, like, computers that cost, like, $30 million that have to be kept at, like, negative sub, sub, uh, sub-arctic freaking temperatures because they run so hot. Yeah, you can join, man. Everybody can join. We're just talking about some crazy stuff over here. Eclipses, computers, and video games. I wonder if I can go back. I bet you with an emulator I could probably get... But you see, that's what I want to be like doing live streams on my PC or something like that, dude. So I might have to step this up a bit and try to get a PC like system going on here too next to my P uh, PlayStation just so I can do do different things and then also i wouldn't like to i'd like to live stream through like my pc somehow so i gotta figure out how to do that things like i got some uh projects that i'm trying to figure out for for this summer to make like the gaming and the channel like better connect with more people have more fun do more video games basically it's all over the place because i there's, there's one thing that i love that i know it I know this. I found this out a long time ago. It's like I love video games. Like there, there are many t times where I've lied to myself. And I'm like, nope, I'm done with this game. And then guess who's coming right back? Just like a crack addict. 
Can I can I just get one can I just get one more hit? I'm gonna try this boss battle just one more time. You right? <laughs> like dude, video games are addicting. Seriously. Like people who play video games as much as I do, like you come to find out, you know, it's like you stop playing video games for a bit, you start getting the shakes, <laughs> you're like getting a little getting a little sick. <laughs> just Just give me something, man. Just give me something. Give me a little Mario. <laughs> just give me anything. Some I candy crush, some damn it, I'll take anything! <laughs> Oh, so we tennis. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Mort Morton's law. Whatever. Wait, did I say it right? Yeah, Mort Moore's law. There you go. You know what I'm talking about. So like in another in another six months we'll have like better better graphics and better better everything. We're all, dude, we're already slipping into like eight K. I don't know if you noticed this or not, but like you, you see these transitions where, like, at some point, it was, like, there wasn't even HD. And then, like, it went into HD. And then from HD, where did it go? It went into, like, kind of, like, slipped into, like, 2K, right? Like, 2K was, like, the thing. And now it's, like, 4K. Like, 4K is just, like, just like normal, right? And then it's going to be, like, 8K. And then it's going to be, like, 12K. And then it's just going to keep going. You're going to be able to, like, jump into your jump into your TV and just, like, be there. <clears throat> well, I can tell you this much. If I if I was actually at the LS car meet, by this time, I'd have to go to the bathroom. And guess what? Rockstar didn't put any bathrooms in the LS car meet. But you know what? They did put a whole bunch of soda pops. So this is what I suggest we do. We drink a whole bunch of soda pops, and we just give Rockstar a little bit of an idea of where we can go, to, why they need to be a bathroom in here, a bathroom, a bar, and a fight club, okay? And maybe maybe uh, let's have a little burger shots and some and some some cluck and bell while we're at it. Why not? Just a little cu couple food stands right over there. Plenty of room for it. Plenty of room. Seventy four parking spots in here. Let's just use one of the one of the parking spots that we can't use. One of the forty four empty parking spots that we can't use. Not a whole lot, man. We're just chilling for a little bit. Uh, decided to do a live stream. Just wanted to give people the uh, an opportunity to come through and get some uh, modded cars. I got this monkey in here that keeps following me around. Yeah, I was a little surprised to see the monkey. I'm not too surprised because of the things that I've seen. You want to see some crazy... You want to see some real crazy stuff? Dude, I'm telling you. Just start playing on PC. That's, that's where all the... I don't know, good things and bad things. Like, I'm pretty sure, like, you do you want to know why you probably don't see any videos? Like, hey, how to make how to make a, a million dollars on PC? Because they have they have money drops over there. People, dude, people come through public sessions and drop everybody just billions of dollars. Just like, pfft, there you go. Now you're rich. <laughs> there you go. Like, that's what happens on PC. People are like worried about modded modded accounts or something like that, dude. Just go on a PC. Like someone someone with a mod menu will just end up dropping you money or something like that. Like they literally just have menus that you get to just make outfits like mine. It's it's all free too. <laughs> a lot of people though, they're stuck on console. I understand why. It's a little bit more affor affordable potentially, but they do have PCs out there that are, you know, I don't know. If it, if it comes between like PlayStation Five Pro or for GTA for GTA Six or PC, I'm I don't know, man. I'm probably dipping both ways just because. Because I know I'm gonna get better better FPS probably off of PC. So what do we do? We're stuck on 60 FPS. How good is that for anybody? It's not the best. Okay, it's better than 30. It's better than 40. It's better than 45. 60 is okay. 60 is like the bare minimum of where we should be anyways. But like, dude, 120, 120 is so much better. Or even you go up beyond that. 240? Get to 240? Just a smooth two, 240 FPS? Think about that for an F, for, for a first-person shooter game. Oh, yeah. Turn it around. Clicking that button. Making sure those headshots count. Yeah, they can. They can. You got that right. They got that uh, solo. So you, <laughs> yeah, on PC, I don't know if you guys knew this or not, but any, um, 
like for for Kyle Perico, you have like solo Kyle Perico replay glitches. So they just go in there solo, and then they just restart their restart their application on PC, and then they load back in and like they still have Kyle, so they get to do those solo over there. Well, one of the things that's a little bit annoying too, I I think, is some of the games that we play here on console. Like, and then on PC, like, they have a lot more options on PC, you know? Like, I want to play certain games on PC and then other games just basically on console. Because there's a lot of games I cannot play with mouse and keyboard. I'm not going to lie. I cannot play. I cannot play certain games, no, with the mouse and keyboard. It's ridiculous. <gasps> Got the hiccups. I was eating pe peanut butter and, and crackers. <laughs> Protein. Per serving, peanut butter has the equivalent of seven grams of protein. Oh, you got the truck. All right. It's, she's a drifter. Let me tell you, you drive that in the snow time. All right. We've been at this for about... Uh, we'll do this for probably like another... Mm, I would like to go for another 40 minutes, but that's, that's asking a lot. I got to keep talking. Let's let's look some crazy stuff up on the internet, huh? What should we what should we look up? You see, that's what I'm saying. Maybe sometime I should just live stream. I should just live stream on my PC, then we could just look some crazy stuff up on. Go, we'll go watch some TikTok. <laughs> Dude, look up the solar eclipse stuff, man. You could be you could look that up right now. What would I call it though? What do you look up? You like solar eclipse? What? Uh, conspiracy just theories. Just the uh, the October what was uh, April eighth solar eclipse conspiracy. April eighth. Oh, so it's like there's a lot of con TikTok conspiracy theories. People on TikTok. I don't. I'm not on TikTok. No, 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 I'm not talking about, I'm not on TikTok either. I'm talking about, it's, it's like, on yeah, the I'm news. on this website right now that's just talking about a lot of the stuff, though, too, that people are, that people are saying. <sighs> yeah, I don't have TikTok either, yeah. This has to do with, like, this one website that I'm reading right now. It's, like, talking about some unmasking of the, uh, of the Antichrist during the eclipse, and... <sighs> <clears throat> but on. there's also with like the with the flares and like electricity like there's supposed to be a lot of shit that's going down with it supposedly there's another thing too that i was reading here so um if you're exposed to the eclipse it can make you sick and there's something that's called eclipse sickness that people are talking about mm-hmm and it's like, I, I don't know. And they're talking other things, too. There's uh, people that are talking about potentially getting, we're going to get blasted with, uh, we're going to get blasted with something, you know. You, you guys know, too, if we get hit with, like, a good solar flare, like, all the electricity is, like, done. <laughs> like, your computer's not going to turn on, your car's not going to work, like, nothing's going to work. We'll, we'll be back to, like, you know, day one. No communications will work. All the satellites will be done. Everything like that. That's a good name for a video game right there. Day one. Is it? Is it because you've been playing DayZ? <laughs> <laughs> we'll give it some day. Ah, it's all right. Day one, if you think about it, I guess. And it's like you're setting to you're setting this like the very first day after all this stuff happens. So the very first intro is like. Yeah. Is like basically it's just not not anything terribly. That'd be actually pretty cool of a game too. Like right in the beginning, but you know, like that one that one movie, um, the zombie movie. God, which one is it called? Uh, Day Day of the No Dawn of the, Dawn of the Dead. Because there's so many of them, right? Dawn of the Dead, the one where they're, at the, where they're at the mall, where like it just begins, like right then. You know what I'm saying? Like they're in the mm -hmm. very threshold of the beginning of the outbreak, instead of like it already being a pretense thing. And then you just get to live this life out. I don't know. I can imagine some pretty cool uh, ideas for some video games and things like that. It's just, unfortunately, I don't think that they were there necessarily at the computing power that we should. 
people have to understand too, dude. It takes like a long time to make to make video games. So like a video game that they started making like ten years ago could be potentially, you know, it's not gonna be like today's standard of graphics. Yeah. It's gonna be like ten years ago. Like this was good. This was like the best ten years ago. You know what I'm saying? It's all. It's always like a gradual thing. Cause like if you if you look at it the way that video games are going, like I watched a documentary on this before, and it's just talking about how these these days it's taking it's taking more people, more money, and more time to to make these video games. You know, than it ever has ever before taken to make any type of video games because of the immersiveness and the time and everything that has to go into you know because that's the de that's the demand for it these days i would say people want 3d aspect open world video games where they get to hang out with all their all their friends and stuff like that like like this game right here 10 years old but still there's like a bunch of people in here we're all able to like be in the same session i think this is like pretty cool technology <clears throat> Yeah, you join the crew, dude. Here, I'll give you a crew link. Join the crew, and then join the crew session. Um, I'm going to be doing this for a little bit longer, not terribly too long, because okay. it is getting late, and i got to get to some other video games, honestly. Wait, you just got banned on PC for what? What'd you do? Yeah. What'd you do? You cannot, you cannot buy Lost Land bands here, dude. No, there's a bunch of vehicles we're not able to buy here. You can't buy LD Organics fans here either. I have one of those. Actually, the LD Organics fan that I have, I'm, I'm, I'm so proud that I have it. Like, it's not modded or anything. It's just like the OG LD Organics fan, and I got it for completing the agency career challenge, man. Like all of it. You need an invite over here, dude. Oh yeah, I was gonna call in another vehicle, wasn't I? My bad. Get spacey sometimes. I was out in the parking lot smoking a J. <laughs> What you want? Some wheels? What do, you, what do you think? Bring in the dune? Bring in the dune. Did anybody watch the second half to the the dune saga? I right, I'll get back to work. No, I watched. I only watched like maybe three quarters of the first one. Well, what was really funny is because when I was playing um the south the South Park game, whatever. So. Because I don't know if you guys are up to date with everything. But I guess at one point, yeah, um, Mr. Hankey did end up getting, like, canceled out of South Park. But they brought him back for, like, this video game. And then, like, at the very end, his, like, his end phase was, like, he was just, like, a really, he was, like, a giant turd. Like, like a worm from Dune. And that, it was just, like, you know, because they were probably talking about how crappy the, how crappy the movie is and stuff like that. And they, they crap on a lot of things, too, and make fun of it. I, you'd have to watch it. Uh, if you guys want to watch all the cutscenes, I have that on my channel. I mashed them all up into like one one movie kind of. It's like 30 32 minutes of like an episode. I cut out all the gameplay. 5 5 hour game or something like that. They wanted 30 hmm. bucks for that, dude. You know how glad I am I got that for free. Yeah, pirating pirating video games is a lot better than buying them. <laughs> I'm still waiting on that new Dragon Dogma, dude. I wanted to freaking do that game. So, so I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, okay, there's a brand new game. It just came out. It's the second version of Dragon Dog uh, Dogma One. This is the newer version. It's an RPG game. I don't know if you guys have heard of it or not or whatever, but this would be like the second version that just came out. It took them over like 11 years to make or something because the original came out in like 2011. St Really good game, if you guys are looking into it. The older one and potentially the newer one. But here's the thing that I'm talking about is in this video game, supposedly what they have done is they've made the character creation so immersive, people are actually able to make real-life people. And that's what they've been doing on this video game. Like, someone, like, I was watching this video, like, this dude who made, like, uh, Michael Saris. Like, they made all these people, like, Jonah Hill, uh... Uh, Seth Rogen, all this stuff. It's crazy. And like these people like who made these characters, like they look like th like they're showing like slides or something like that. Like here's the, here's what they look like in real life and like here's the video game and like their character in the video game looks exactly like the way that they did it. You know what I'm saying? Because it's one of the most Im it's it's already been going on right now. It's one of the most immersive character creation 
for for any type of video game that that's ever been created so far. So it's like super immersive. You know what I'm saying? How skinny you are, how tall you are, you you know everything, everything, and then facial features and stuff like that. Super immersive, I guess. So if you wanted to, you could like make you potentially. You know, you could like make you if you had like a portrait of you or something. If you knew what you like, you looked like. Could you could you draw a picture of you if you if you just? I couldn't draw a picture. Monkey, stop it! This damn monkey. We need a we need a uh, an old priest and a young priest. I re I repeat, we need a young priest and an old priest. They're pushing me. You're being a bully. I'm trying to call out a car, bro. You know, that's funny that you're a monkey because I watched this movie, Congo, one time. <laughs> that monkey's in it, too. You need something, huh? One of your rides? Let me know. This is one. Of, this is like uh, a pretty good one right here, though, too. It's on the way. This is the Calico GTF, right there. Love that. Love that car. It's a good car. Someone does. <laughs> Someone's got to. For the love. For the love of God. Oh, the main story mode characters? Gotcha. There's a lot of them in there, dude. I, I'd almost want to bring in the doctor. There's like a doctor in there or something like that. I always wanted to be a doctor in GTA. Be like, I'm just like, roll up to players and be like, yeah, that, that arm's got to go. <laughs> and just shoot him in the arm. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Tracy. Wait, yeah, is Tracy in there? She's not in there, is she? What about Tracy or Jimmy? I just would love it if they brought in a bong for a melee weapon like like we did have <laughs> in, in Story. Yeah. I was, al I was always suspecting that they would have a bong or something for a melee weapon. I thought it would be a cool melee weapon, too. Like getting hit by a, a big bong? That, that would hurt, right? Worse than getting hit with a candy, a candy cane, an oversized candy cane. Come on now. You know what's going to happen? You hit somebody with a candy cane, it's going to break. Now, if you hit somebody with one of those big plastic bongs, that potentially won't break. All right, it might break. It'll probably break. Either or. Yeah, but how cool would that be, dude? Glass bong. Every single time that you hit somebody with it, it, it shatters or something. You just... Glass. Glass damage. It's like having no shoes and Daisy stepping on rocks or broken glass. <laughs> get your cars, get your modded cars. Yo, is this car used? So you're telling me all these cars are used. They're all used. Can't buy the Deluxo in here. Wait, is that a Deluxo? That's not a Deluxo, is it? What is that? Okay, never mind. There's like a merge car over here. Yeah, no, I still got lots of room too. Lots of money. Basically, basically, I'm good for the rest of GTA. Until GTA 6 gets here and there's going to be a super grind. 
I'll be grinding. I'm gonna be grinding that game for like a year straight, man. Can't wait. I I love brand new video games that like that make you lose sleep, dude. I don't know if you guys like know what I'm talking about, but I love those type of games. It's just a, it's just like something new that you get to experience and you get into it. You know, you're just like this is cool. I just wish I had time to play a little bit more different video games. I've been in this match for literally an hour now. You in Call of Duty still? Or are you in? Uh... Uh, I'm in my, my second match, yeah, of zombies. And this one, I've literally been in here for an hour. It's what are you, what are you very, doing in there? Very, are you just very, like parking very, it, going AFK, end. or is that? Can you even go AFK in there? You're not gonna get kicked, right? I don't know, but uh, I come. In, I'm in here right now, killing zombies, like ranking up weapons at the same time. Oh I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. To do the battle pass. I still have to shoot stuff, but the problem is, is like I said, I've literally been in here for an hour now. I'm the last one on the map, and this is the last. <laughs> You're the last one. Everybody else is left. Gas is coming. Yeah, this you can join, man. Just join, join the crew, then join the crew session. We're not going to be doing this for terribly too much longer because I'm gonna, I'm gonna schedule for things that I want to get done tonight. Bocce Champion. Oh, the Champion. I think I know that car. That's a Nami Tech vehicle. So if you wanted to buy like an Nami Tech vehicle, what you'd have to do is um, you got to take the weapons off of it. You have to unweaponize the Nami Tech, basically. So yeah, because we can't buy weaponized vehicles over here, but we can still buy vehicles that can potentially be weaponized, but they can't have we weapons on them. I don't know. It's kind of weird. It's stupid too. At the same time, where I don't understand why Rockstar would just like how you would have that decision of like, hey, let's just make these cars available, but not these other cars. But they'll be able to bring all that other stuff in there. Oh, and by the way, yeah, let it, let them buy a festival bus in there. By the way, <laughs> like what? Once again, it's called Rockstar logic. It makes no sense. Not to me. Not to you. Not to anybody. Probably not even them. For all we know, they're they're writing down stuff and picking it out of a hat or something like that. It's a it's a it's like bingo. They're like J J four, what? <clears throat> well, what is that? What is that right there? Bingo. <laughs> We're not talking about a dog either named Bingo. <laughs> is there, I think there was a dog, and once upon a time, his name was Bingo. Was his, bingo was his name, oh. Yeah, B I go. <laughs> B I N go. Wait, your son and your dad are the owners of Your son and your dad are the owners of Epic, of Epic Games? Can we get can we get some some V-bucks over here? Not a lot, just a little. Like half of a V-buck. I want half a V buck. <laughs> Just one. Honestly, I think too, like when the new Wolverine game comes out, probably what will happen is they'll probably put Wolverine back in Fortnite. I'm surprised that I'm not in Fortnite by now. I think they've made something like me. <laughs> like they bring in everybody, dude. They brought in like Dune characters. Like, come on now. They're not, they weren't even necessarily good either. You see, like, Venom? Venom's a cool one. I would take Venom over uh, Black Spider-Man. Venom's, like, way better, I think. He looks really cool. Because it's Venom. Terminator's cool, too. A uh, bunch of them in there. Almost, almost any Dragon Ball <laughs> character is cool because I'm a Dragon Ball nerd. Set myself up here at some point. I'm probably gonna get in there and play some Bardock. There's a lot of other stuff though that's coming to the freaking that's coming to the game besides like what what it is, dude. Like, oh, it's crazy. Yeah, because when I bought Kakarot, it was like in 2020 or something like that, and the game first came out. Great video game, by the way, if you like Dragon Ball. Like, one of the best Dragon Ball video games I've ever played.
Hey, dude, you gotta join. You gotta join the crew, man. Yeah, we got a little monkey running around here. Kept pushing me. I was about ready to go in passive mode. <laughs> I felt like I was getting assaulted. I was I was getting abused by a little monkey. <laughs> Did he leave? Did a little monkey leave? Or is he still running around here somewhere? Yeah, they put no bathrooms in here. I'm just gonna use this the use the shoe box. <laughs> Don't worry, they don't have any good shoes over here anyways. Another cop car coming through. What is that, the Terminus? Got the Terminus. Chameleon. Shiny, shiny green bennies it looks like on that. All right, you guys, we're, we're at uh, about 19 minutes here. I'm going to end this because I got to go... Uh, Got to go do my rounds here and then get back. And I want to play some other other games tonight, potentially, here. More video games. What's up, Batman Joker? Yeah, I'm going to go grab something to eat, Grave. I'll be back. Tacos? Uh, I don't know, man. My daughter made some pretty uh, dish. Homemade food is better. Yeah. All right, homie. Yeah, I'll be back. Yeah, no worries, dude. I'm stay, I'll be I'm around. A, I'm going to stay in the, yep, Yeah, I'm no worries. I'll, I'll be around. Unless I, unless I leave because I got to go to the track because I, I go do exercises. Got to go. Got to go run. Got to go run it out. Run amok. There's a school nearby that's got like a track that I like to go to. Besides, it's really nice out right now at nighttime. Go look for UFOs. Actually, I, I do. I go out there and I look for UFOs. Because like I've seen some UFOs. Dude, I swear to God, I've seen something. I don't know what they, I don't know what it is, but I've seen some crazy things, man. I've seen some weird stuff before. Not like... You know, not no zigzags or anything like that, but at some point, I'm hoping to see like some stuff. I even seen some green, some green stuff at one point, dude. There was like three green things. We were, like, what are those? Like, I thought it was like the color green because I like the color green, and like the aliens were communi communicating, especially just to me, and, like tele telepathic uh, communication going on. Batman Joker, need to buy a vehicle. What what car? I have a lot of cars, dude. Uh, the one that I have out right now is this. Looks like somebody probably already bought it, though. They have it over here. This is the Calico GTF. I made this car. I made it. I made that car. If it's got a grave plate, like, you know that I made it. Does this have a grave plate? That's got a grave plate. That means that means I made it, cause I put gra grave on all my plates when I made them. When I made them and the chance for them, the F ones, pure whites. Some sort of really cool looking green here. I really like this green too. This is a nice green. It's like a glowy, shiny green, and like you let the light hit this, it's got like you know, you get a really good looking color, dude. Your color changes. Your color changes from the light. You got like light sensitive colored cars. The Hermes. The Hermes. The car that can't even drive over a curb. I don't think this car can drive over a curb. I'm serious. Yeah, so we're going to end this here very shortly. So come on through. Get some modded vehicles. We'll be doing this again, of course, here on the channel. Lots of. We still got a long time before GTA 6. And every, it seems like every single time that I do this, too, I end up buying, I buy, like, a car, too, which is awesome. We get some dope modded cars to share with the peoples. Get these out. This is the bee's knees. 
Just try to get some, just get like some decent variety of, of vehicles too. Uh, I'm trying to pick up some more binnies too these days. Uh, not so much on the F1s. At one point I went too heavy on the F1s because I like F1s better, potentially. What? Two years GTA 6? No, dude. Next year. Next year. GTA 6. Oh, I can send you an invite, too, if you get into the session and you need, like, an invite in here. There you go. Uh, GTA 6 should be in, like, what? A little... A year... A year and... I'm gonna say, like, 15 months, maybe. We'll probably... We'll probably see GTA six hopefully about 15 months what do you think year one year three months probably i don't know we, we've had a lot of discussions too because i can tell you this dude it's not going to drop like on january 1st of 2025 like the the next thing that we need to be rooting for is like this next trailer when is the next trailer going to drop does anybody know the number for the new the gta 6 trailer we should look that up real quick How many views are we looking at here for the GTA 6 trailer? Let's look. Holy moly. It has 183 plus million. This thing has over a million likes. And I'm one of the ones who hit the like button too because it says right down here. I'm one of the million. I was like one of the first, dude. I couldn't believe that they dropped that. It was so crazy. Yeah, because, dude, if you've been playing any of Rockstar's games, you know one thing that they like to do is delay things. They're like, oh, just a few more months, you guys. Just a few more months. Just give us, like, six more months. <laughs> You're like, what? Hey, look, dude. All I know is this, okay? Regardless from what we don't know about the game, this is what we do know. The trailer's out. The trailer is out. It says 2025, okay? So this is what, like, we're going to be looking forward to. It's going to be the next stage evolution in Grand Theft Auto. And let's hope they did make they take their time with it to where they made the game immersive and it's going to be great. Like everything's going to be great. The story's going to be great. Like come on now. Rockstar doesn't make bad games, dude. They do not make bad games. We know this. The characters that are going to be in GTA 6 have to be they're going to be awesome. It's, it's got to be, right? Yeah, that's what I would say, man. I, I'm just going to be patient with it because you can't just sit there and like, oh, any day now, GTA 6. Like, I would just say enjoy enjoy life as it is. You know, G we know that it's on the way. Like, we know. We've known this for a long time. But it, look, at least at least Rockstar has finally confirmed it within, you know, not that long ago with their, tra with their trailer. 183 million views. Dude, that thing is going to see well over 200 million views before before Jason's trailer gets dropped. That's for certain. Yeah, before Jason's trailer? Yeah, for sure, dude. Thanks, you guys. It's gonna be it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be so exciting too. It's gonna be so exciting. Like super exciting to be able to play GTA six. Like the speed speedrunners, but like I beat GTA six in one day, now now what? <laughs> Let's take my time with that game, man. Side missions, everything. Easter eggs. Oh, man. There's going to be so much stuff to do in a brand new video game. Like, dude, I've been here like the last 11 years playing this game. I've done everything there is to do. I've done all the glitches. I've seen all the Easter eggs under the ocean and in Cayo Perico and on the land, water, ocean, all that crap. There's not a place that I haven't been on this map. Not one place that I haven't been. There's not anything that I haven't experienced necessarily. There may be a mission or two that I haven't done, but like, whatever. I've experienced most of the game. I was I was there in story mode pick, picking up 
spaceship part so I could build my space docker. <laughs> Have I got one online? Hell no. Yeah, we're going to end this in just a little bit. Because I'm not doing this all night, technically. Try to keep on the schedule. Got more videos coming out, too, hopefully. As long as I can stay awake. Keep playing GTA. Yeah, I appreciate everybody coming through. You guys are awesome. Yeah, another thing, too, I wanted to let everyone know that's here. Like, we got more things that are going to be planned for this channel besides just, like, you know, doing this stuff. Like, there's a lot of video games out there. There's a lot of missed opportunities, potentially, on my part, where I wanted to be more engaged with people, potentially, to where, like, we're not just doing GTA 5, but I got to gotta figure out how to, like, live stream on my PC, too. So, I know that there's, like, tutorials on how to do things out there. So, well, we're going to try to make this summer, like, extra fun. 2024 summer coming right around the corner trying to make this one a good one the game is going to be like officially 11 years old gta 6 is right around the corner let's just let's just hope to god that uh, the next dlcs that they they're going to put in the game are going to be like really good ones everybody's everybody wants the michael dlc i think i think everybody at this point is rooting for the michael dlc like hell i'd even be rooting for the the michael dlc Franklin already got his dude. It's called the agency Franklin got his so everybody thought that like we're getting a Michael DLC like we have to like we have to right like come on Oh, yeah, a lot of the vehicles in here are super expensive, dude Yeah, just to let you know. Yeah, you're gonna you're gonna fold your bankroll potentially coming into a session and Buying a lot of modded cars. That's why you just get the really, really good ones. Super good ones. There's a there's a modded hatchback. Pew. Yeah, then once again, we will be doing this again. Um, I'm not too sure about tomorrow of doing a uh, live stream for the gift cars to friends. We're probably going to wait for Thursday just because they might have a brand new car coming in. I don't think that they do this this next week, though, honestly. I don't think that we're going to get any new... I don't think that we're going to get any new vehicles until, like, probably after 420. Like, yeah, I don't know. Because 420 is going to be coming right around the corner here in GTA, which I don't even... I haven't even looked at the date. Oh man, no way, dude. 420 is actually on a Saturday, so we're going to be doing a 420 live stream. That's going to be fun. We're going to go to a weed a weed store and get some get some weed. <laughs> nah, screw that. Save save my money. I'll save my money for video games. Thank you. Yeah, it looks like this year 420 is gonna actually be on a Saturday. That's gonna be, that's gonna be cool. That'll that'll be a fun live stream. Hopefully they got some fun stuff going on that week too that we can. I I'm I'm more than certain they're gonna be having something to do with the uh, the marijuana business, the MC marijuana business in the game. Yeah. Uh, the fact that they have unselected, unselected features to them. That's what makes them modded. Cannot buy in store. So let, let's go over mine real quick. Uh, number one, the paint is modded. You cannot get that paint. Cannot make the paint. Cannot get that color. Number two, 
See these tires? Those are F1 tires. You can't put F1 tires on a car like this. See the windows? Those are green tinted windows, unselected. Look at the license plate back here, North Yankton. You can't get North Yankton license plates. That's what makes this modded. This is a 100, this is a pure modded vehicle right here. This is clean. That's a clean car right there. Pure white too, pure white on the, on the rims. You can't necessarily get pure white unless what? You use it for a crew color, but can you put crew color as a rim color? I don't think you can. Nope. That's a big difference right there. So basically it's just unselected or selected. Same thing was like this over here. Looks like the color, unselected. Tires, unselected. Uh, windows, unselected. We also have North Yankton license plate. That's unselected as well. So it's the rarity of it too, because you're not able to do any of this stuff normally in a garage. Can't, can't, won't, won't let you. Not allowed. Rockstar is like, no. Something so simple that you, you can easily do, we're not going to allow you to do it. Why not? Yeah, why not? Dude in... Are you, are you seriously wearing sandals and socks? Who does that? What are you doing? You lounging around the house? Hey, space monkey. Where'd the other little monkey go? The little, little monkey left. He's out of here. Yeah, we're calling it, guys. Uh, this is we're gonna end this real soon. We got like four four minutes here, probably. I mean, I could do this longer potentially, but I got I got stuff I wanted to do. Maybe I needed to start a live stream earlier. Wait, how long? When did I start this? Oh, it's like ten now. It is, man. Yeah, we should have done that earlier. Maybe we'll do another one tomorrow because I didn't do as long as one today. What do you guys think? Wake up tomorrow. We'll get a weekly update informational video out. And then after that, just hook up another live stream probably and trade some modded cars over here in Grand Theft Auto 5 online. Yeah, it's, it's stuff like that. It's... Things like that, potentially. Through to your garage. You uh, need me to bring you a ride? I'll get there as soon as I can. Now I think if you get the lifeguard, it's not going to include the thing. The thing on the top here. This is a modded, modded red with the F1s. Yeah, it's got F1s on it, four-wheeler. Take this bad boy in the test track area real quick. Wow, that test track area sure is slow. Yeah, I don't think anybody can join me either when I'm, when I'm in here. Oh, dude, this thing is so slow. We're not driving this. Look at that, though. It's modded. It's modded. It's modded. All right, yeah, let's go back in there. That's not very fast, though, dude. I don't, I don't like vehicles that go slow. I like fast cars. When are they gonna get? When are they gonna give me a spaceship? That'd be cool, dude. If we actually got a spaceship in like the very end of GTA, right? The very end of GTA, spaceship. 
Sell stuff? Oh, yeah. You guys could be selling some things, too, potentially, if you're in the session. It looks like it's dying down a little bit. We were going to end this here. We got a cool 27 people watching right now. Appreciate everybody coming through. It's 10 o'clock where I live. It's got to be late where you guys are, too. Pure white? Is this pure white? Or is that just a regular car right here? This is like a regular car. I got a few of these too right here. The Ghostbuster car? I think that'd be popular right now with the new Ghostbuster movie that just came out. I don't know. Maybe I'll rewatch it or something like that. It just seems lame. We got these teenagers or something like that. They're like Ghostbusters. And it just... You're like, where's... Where is that? I don't know. Why do people got to get old? <laughs> Pete Vinkman? And then supposedly there's a new video game that came out as well, like a VR, a VR video game or something. They had one too, a video game. I played it a couple times here on the channel. The Ghostbusters video game was pretty good, too. Voice with all the real actors as well. I think the only actor that they didn't have in there was, like, the, uh... The little, the little nerdy dude with the... The glasses? What was his name? Hmm. Yeah, I can't remember his name. Get your cars, get your cars, get your modded cars. What's that? Rick? Rick Morales? Morales? Whoa! Yeah, I need to go make some more uh, modded outfits here at some point. I've been wanting to do that. I need to go on one of my other accounts, though. It's gonna go do the transfer glitch and see what we can come up with. Start, start making some more outfits in there. It's not too hard to do, but like, yeah. Make like the individual outfits and then... Where are you going, Blue? What are you wearing? Call up the old mechanic. See what's going on here. You calling for some wheels? I'm Johnny on the spot. I'll hook you up. Johnny on the spot's about to hook me up. Let's see what we got here. I'll bring it by. You like it? You like the new gen Ghostbusters? Okay, well I've seen like a little bit about it, and here's just something that I'm not feeling is like the new the new kids or something like that. So I don't know, man. How heavy how heavy did they say that those proton packs are? Nine ninety pounds, okay? That one chick doesn't even weigh ninety pounds. And she's got a proton pack on. That's not believable. 
You want to you want to see somebody? With, it'd be like a dude like me, all right? Like six foot something, two hundred some pounds, tromping around in a Ghostbuster outfit. As a matter of fact, I just got an idea for what I'm gonna be next year for Halloween. It's gonna be a Ghostbuster, probably. All right, you guys. So I said I was gonna end this. Uh, it looks like this is dying down. So we're gonna go ahead and end this right now because we have schedule to keep. So get your get your modded cars right now. This is it. We'll do another one of these tomorrow earlier. How about that? Well, after we, after I get the weekly uh, update out, we'll have that out for a couple hours, and then after that, we'll do like a live stream for a big chunk of a big chunk of the day getting modded modded cars. That little monkey's gone. Thank God that little thing was following me around. Creepy little dude coming in as a monkey. Cool outfits, you guys. Cool cars. Cool people. Coolness. I hope everybody's doing good and having an awesome rest of the day. Gravesite, Green Alien, and I'm out of here, okay? We'll catch you guys tomorrow in another live stream. So be sure to make sure to have the post notifications on. Hit that like button, okay? Don't always not hit the like button because we need you to hit the like button. I don't care how many times you got to hit the like button. You got to hit it. I have to do it. You do it. You do it too. It's a, it'll be like a us thing here all right awesome anyways green alien and i am out of here i appreciate all you guys' awesomeness and i will see you tomorrow in another live stream where we trade more some more modded cars gravesite it's gravesite that's my name and i'm out of here